What is up, Boxing Now on YouTube? Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Victor Ortiz was arrested last night. He's supposed to fight on Sunday. Uh, so we're going to get into that. But before I do that, this is my Instagram. Check me out on Instagram. Follow me on Instagram. I post all kinds of crazy videos and pictures and all that good stuff. Uh, also, I have Canelo Alvarez stickers that I'm selling. I was supposed to have them in for the fight uh, before the Triple G fight. That didn't happen, so now I got 200 of them. Uh, if you guys want to see more stickers of different fighters, I can sell them. They're really cheap. It's only 4 bucks, and it supports the channel. Uh, also, for members of the channel, if you want to send me a message with your address, I'll send you one for free. Uh, I appreciate your membership. That's fantastic. Thank you. Um, so, Victor Ortiz was arrested yesterday, charged with forcible rape, forcible oral, and forcible digital penetration. Three felonies. Uh, he was released on $100,000 bail. He is scheduled to fight John Molina Jr. on Sunday on FS1. And I would think that that fight would be canceled until I just read that uh, they are going to go on with the fight. So there was a statement that came out from someone inside that said, and this is a quote, he's going to fight. We got him out of jail. He's home. This is from an official connected to the card at Citizens Business Bank Arena who spoke on the condition uh, and did not want to reveal his identity. So I, I guess they're kind of proud of the fact that they got him out of jail. Listen, the guy's facing a rape charge, right? This is not an important fight in his career. As far as I'm concerned, his career is, is, is over. This is a money grab. Um, he's quit on his stool far too many times for anyone to really take uh, significant interest in this fight. Uh, I like Victor Ortiz, but he's done the fans wrong um, one too many times. And he's got bigger things to worry about at this point than a fight with John Molina Jr. Um, yeah, out of respect for the victim, I don't think he should fight. And the seriousness of the charges, I don't think he should fight. I just, I don't think it's right. Uh, I'm completely against it. And I want to know what your thoughts and opinion are. Um, this isn't a little thing. This isn't a guy getting drunk in a bar and, you know, ass simply assaulting someone. This is rape. This is a rape charge. And they have enough cause to actually charge him with three felonies, right? So the probability is there that he probably did this, okay? Uh, I know you're innocent until proof, proven guilty, but I don't get, um, I, I don't understand what the uh, World Boxing Council gets out of this, uh, with this fight going on. Um, it doesn't make sense to me. Uh, I don't know what to do. I, I don't know what to think. So, what do you guys think? Should he fight? Should he not? Uh, I appreciate it. Thanks for watching. Peace.